Guys, thanks a lot. Here with Cam Cameron. First of all, welcome to LSU. Thank you. What excites you most about this Tigers offense? The players. Um, had a chance to meet them, uh, uh, a few of them yesterday. I'll get, I'll be in touch with them all in the next few days. But uh, um, the players, and, 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 and intertwined in that is this coaching staff. And uh, um, these guys are on board. Um, I'm, I'm going to really do a, uh, the best job I can of getting all the feedback uh, that I can get from the staff and from the players here in a short period of time. And then we'll kind of collectively, you know, then kind of put that evaluation together. Okay, now where do we want to move from here? How can we get better? That's the bottom line, just coming here to, uh, to help these players get better and help, help, help our team get better. The background with Coach Miles, obviously well documented, seven years serving uh, as an assistant under Bo at Michigan. Right. And you've, you said at your introductory news conference today, you've watched every LSU game over the last eight years, Coach. Oh. How have you done that? And what is your impression, I guess, of what you've seen from Zach Mettenberger? Well, first of all, any of this bald spot back here is, is not all from the National Football League. It's uh, those LSU games, uh, just there's nothing like it, you know, and some had some had some great wins. Uh, you know, and as it relates to Zach, you know, I, I've I've been following him really for quite some time. We have a guy, a personnel guy, I really respect him, Joe Hortiz, who said Cam is a great young quarterback coming out of high school, and uh, we'll be looking at him in four or five years. So um, and then he surfaces here. And um, um, obviously, he and I talked yesterday. He's on board with getting better. I think it's probably a little premature until I'm around him. I got to kind of find out why the good decisions he was make. Why was he making them? Some of the ones he might take back. You know, what was he thinking? Once we kind of sit down and can get through all that, I think I'm going to have a better view. But uh, he's the kind of guy that a coordinator and a quarterback guy gets excited about coaching. Final question. I know Coach Harbaugh has already texted you about what size ring do you wear, and you spoke glowingly about your five years with the Ravens. Would not trade those five years for anything in the world. The people there, the respect I was treated with, even through the process. When you're getting texts from players on the way to the to the Super Bowl and coaches, and uh, wonderful group, couldn't be happier for those guys. And uh, and John is. Uh, uh, you know, the, the question was asked about coaching with a friend, and uh, uh, it doesn't get any better than that because we're, we're grown men. We understand what this business is all about, and uh, sometimes it works out better than others, and you still love each other the same. Coach, not only welcome to LSU, welcome back to the college game. It's been Great. a decade away. Thrilled to be back. Thanks. Thanks, guys. We'll send it back to the Louisiana Cat Studios. Victor, Paul, back to you.